Speaking about the super admin role, as you can see, I've logged out from our Fudopam, which is to show you a tiny difference that is between the user, operator, admin and super admin. So I've modified my account already. Of course, we'll get back to the previous settings once I will show you the options uh, of the initial configuration. So let's log in. Now, on the left hand side, as you probably noticed already, uh, we do have totally different menu available and the things that I would like to uh, discuss at this point is the system and the network configuration because under the system you will be granted with an option to alter different elements that might be required in your work basically. The first thing that you may to modify is the date and time zone. I'm located in Warsaw, that's the reason why it is placed like this. Supposedly uh, you should be able to adjust it in your own manner. Um, that will be, uh, or if we're speaking about date and time configuration, but also this section is trusted to um, provide all the HTTP certificates, but to set a default domain, all the different parts of your infrastructure. As for this upgrade tab, by selecting the concrete file that has been provided by our team, you may upload your current version, your current photo version to the latest release of ours. You may also create a snapshot, so when something wrong will happen with a virtual machine or your hardware, uh, you may restore it by using that particular snapshot file about licensing uh, license this is something that is very uh, unique at this point including the serial number because as you probably notice at the very end of the installation process the system is generating the unique serial number it should consist of uh, eight different numbers and by sending this to our pre-sales department and maybe sales representative, you should uh, be provided with a license that will, if we're speaking about the type, that will be uh, set out with a testing mode or maybe commercial. As for diagnostics, uh, under this tab, you do have an engine which will allow you to verify the uh, elements, including IP addresses, uh, possible hosts and ports, if they're available or not. Okay, uh, and the second section I would like to cover is the network configuration. As you can see, the interfaces is the place that is interesting us at most. Name and DNS routing IP labels are table proxy. Uh, it is something that you may configure by your own uh, in accordance to your needs, of course. Uh, as for the interfaces, we need this uh, to be done at the very beginning. So the first IP address visible here is the IP address of the admin portal that you can see on screen. Secondary thing, uh, is the IP address that has been assigned to use the portal. And there's a small difference between those two IP addresses. The second one, uh, there is an icon, globe icon, that need to be checked because otherwise it will be also treated as a uh, administration panel. So it's worth to mention about such details.